Welcome to the Architecture Enthusiast and to one of my favorite buildings, the Headship Public Housing Project, completed in 1921 by Michael de Klerk in Amsterdam, the Netherlands. In a relatively short time span in the early 20th century, between 1910 and 1930, the so-called Amsterdam School of Design and Architecture showed the world a passionate synergy between artistic and social movements. The impulse of shaping and producing our living environment, both socially and physically, has changed the face of our cities as well as our daily life. The Amsterdam School stood for as a social movement elevating the population on the basis of progressive and liberal, socialistic and religious ideals by practicing building and architecture, design, crafts and industrial production, art, politics, self-organization and education. As a style in plasticity, grace, movement, equilibrium, meaning and revolutionary architectural and artistic detailing, but deeply rooted in building trade and crafts. In spirituality through symbolism, naturalism, religion, dance and music. The synergy, the total sum of these movements is essential to the understanding of the Amsterdam School. The interaction of these movements was a manifestation of modernity by which it entered the international stage. It heralded everything new and progressive. After the romanticism of Neo styles at the end of the 19th century. Head Ship is an apartment building in the Sparndamerbord district of Amsterdam. Built in the architectural style of the Amsterdam School of Expressionist Architecture. It is the single most important example of this style of architecture using the brick expressionism version. The building was designed by Michael de Klerk. The building vaguely resembles the outlines of a ship. Its appearance is very unconventional from all angles. Headship Housing Complex is a world famous example of the Amsterdam School. Characteristic of this Dutch architectural style from the beginning of the 20th century is the sculptural use of brick combined with embellishments such as sculpture and wrought iron. Furthermore, the often expressive facades are fitted with ladder type windows. According to the architect, nothing was beautiful enough for the worker who had lived so long without beauty. Standing near the northwest side of Amsterdam's historic harbor is an impressive apartment complex aptly named The Ship for its waterside location. Also dubbed the Workers' Palace, the complex advanced an ambitious new type of housing for the working class, an unprecedented experiment in designed living. Designed by Dutch architect Michael de Klerk and completed in 1921, the ship exemplifies how integration of architecture with arts and crafts was at the core of de Klerk's philosophy. Focusing on the high level of craftsmanship that was key to de Klerk's vision and that was paramount throughout the construction of the ship with an eye towards the wealth of decorations that make it so special. A stunning example of the Amsterdam School of Architecture and, de and Design, the ship shows off an essential, perhaps the most important aspect of the school, its celebration and validity of craftsmanship. This value is evident in every aspect of the ship, from its design and construction to the careful choice of materials, decorations and finishes. The complex originally contained 102 apartments, a post office and a nursery school. Built on a triangular lot, the design allowed for an inner court containing small personal gardens and a modest community hall. No detail escaped the clerk's attention, as is evident in the careful placement 
of the strikingly colored brick and the design flourishes such as small carved windmills that adorn its facade. He brilliantly achieved his goal of providing quality housing for those who had never been able to afford it. Headship is distinguished by the innovative use of bricks, tiles, and many charming sculptural ornamentation by Hildo Krop. Imaginative window designs and even the typography is exclusively Amsterdam School.